Hey guys, Supreme Tuft here with another Lego Transformer. So here we have Hover. Now, Hover and Hover, I really couldn't think of a name for the Headmaster. So again, I just called them both Hover. And the little Hover car. Got a little computer console. Got a little place for the Headmaster Hover to stand. And you can even have weapon storage. So thought that was pretty cool, but I'm just going to set that off to the side. Now, Headmaster Hover is quite small. Like, it's smaller than the Matrix. And it's even smaller than a uh, Titan's Return figure. And it's not really articulated. Like, the arms can go back that far and forward that far. It does have a waist swivel, though, which I thought was pretty cool. Then the feet can move forward and back. And yeah, he can sit inside the car. Or if you wanted to, this could be like a cargo thing. And you could just have him stick like right there. Because that's where he'll be in the robot mode. So it could be like a little hover car type thing. But yeah, it's pretty much it for this mode. So let's get down to transformation. So the first thing you want to do to transform him is you just want to rotate out these pieces, then rotate out these back pieces, rotate these forward on their hinges, and just push all that back. Then I like to separate the legs a little bit. Next, you just want to rotate that piece, bring down the arms, and then for the headmaster, just rotate down the feet and then that'll push up the little hands into their head mode and then you just plug it on right there and here you have hover in his robot mode now hover is not anything special he's like a little drone for the autobots or decepticons that's why he doesn't use very many pieces and why he looks like a hunchback but hey, he does have a jetpack. That's pretty cool. Can shoot his gun. Pew pew. All that stuff. For articulation. Can do full 360. Can go up and down. Can't waist swivel question mark. Um, it can. The waist can move forward. <laughs> then these can move up and down. As well as go forward and back. They're just on these pieces. And yeah, he's a really simple build. Like, it's basically based around a 2x2 two two plate with just added stuff on him. I really like how his legs transform, because it's like a double hinge, kind of. Because they fold down and then out. So I thought that was pretty cool. So for some size comparisons, here it is with a minifig. With a Titan's Return figure. And, why not, with Micro. So, that's pretty much it for him. He's going to be a really short video. So, I'm trying to get rid of some of my backlog, because I've been, oh, I'll be leaving for a vacation very soon. So, I'm trying to backlog some videos. So, if you do decide to build this, please be sure to give me credit, since how I built it, but... Thanks for watching.